What's up gamers, in this episode we're doing a lot of Slayer, I did a lot of grinding for this one and I hope you enjoy. So starting off with Wolf, I really need to upgrade this power orb with mana blocks, I've been using this for a long time and yeah, it's just not cutting it, I need something better and I just need one level so let's just get started on that and then we'll move on from there. So we're closing in on a combat level, should be any minute now with a few more kills, I think that's these two, nope one more. Um, maybe one more. No, this guy. There we go. Compot 29. That's nice. That was the last one, and I should have the level now. So let's just call up the Slayer Master. Claim this. There we go. Now I'm Wolf Slayer level 6. Let's just claim this, and then I can make the Mana Flux Power Orb, finally. And the loot from level 5 to level 6. That's all of this. Couple of runes travel scrolls nothing crazy but yeah so i've got all the ingredients let's just go ahead and craft this thing up boom there we go so nice finally let me just go and uh, grab a new slayer hello maddox subscribe to so talk what well if you say so so the next slayer i'm gonna do is revenant i need one more level so i can basically upgrade this healing one that helps a lot and get a better version that's just gonna help me even more so yeah i just need one more level and then we're done finally done with uh, slayer just, uh, for now at least uh, revenant slayer i just need to collect it and i should be level six right after this there we go and now i can craft the uh, uh what is it called want of restoration let's uh, check out the recipe it is you know it's fairly cheap i mean this is kind of expensive not really and the loot is everything in my inventory plus all of the things in here so this is everything got a few rare drops you know nothing worth a lot but you know this is quite a lot of flesh but yeah on to other things just a quick thank you to mr plank for lending me his elephant pet this is going to help a lot for farming because you know i love farming that was sarcasm i do not love farming but this is going to help out a lot so thank you just hit me up when you need it back and now i've got all the items and i can just put them in like so there we go want the restoration and i actually wanted to try something i've got this book in here ultimate vice and i want to try and put that on the wand see if that works and it does you know i'm going to put this on here because then it's going to cost less to use it uh, not by a lot but i'm still gonna do it so after that there's only one thing that i really want to do and let's kill ghosts but i need to upgrade my uh, soul whip a little bit more and i've got all the things i need in here we got swarm titan killer lethality vampirism and thunder lord just a bunch of enchantments that i'm gonna slap on the soul whip probably need some levels but let's just go and do that real quick and there we go got all the enchantments on there that did cost a lot more than i thought but it was definitely worth it and it's time to go kill some ghosts right now these guys are dying a lot quicker than they were before because of derpy and i just got a new bestiary and also this mana flux is coming in very handy right now i have been grinding ghosts for about an hour you know i'm gonna take a break now but here's the loot got a couple of runes Ooh, sorrows nine voltas and four plasmas you know that's not bad for one hour and uh, you know this is quite enjoyable i like doing this a lot more than farming and stuff like that so yeah this is a great money making method and the upgrades that i did earlier on the soul whip they are coming in hand i decided that i should probably complete spider slayer level six and i just need to collect it and then i should be done i mainly just did this to get more crit damage so let's go ahead and collect that here plus two percent crit damage there we go i'm probably not gonna go for the next level i might continue doing revenants but i'm not sure i'm done with it for now so let's go do something else better to come back and i've already got a sorrow probably gonna stay here for about an hour see if i get some loot and i'm also thinking about collecting all the loot that i get just to see how much i get overall and then maybe i'll sell it all once i get you know quite a lot talking like stacks of sorrows or something so for now i'm just gonna continue collecting just wanted to test this new pad out i'm closing in on the next level uh should be happening any minute now 
And there we go, farming 22. Um, this is helping out a lot more than before. Using this path, I'm getting a lot more sugar cane, and that means I'll probably be able to get silver or even gold in the next farming contest that I participate in. But yeah, for now, I'm just trying it out. Just finished another ghost farming session, and this is the loot that I got. And in total, the loot from farming ghosts is 4 sorrow. 10 plasma and 15 volta. I'm just gonna keep collecting this and see how much I can get. I think it's time I do some dungeons. I'm running some 4 5s right now. Maybe I'll join some 4 6 um, later on, but uh, we'll see. So, even with just 3 people, we managed to get an ass. I mean, it's only floor 5, but still. Uh, let's check the loot, rejuvenate, and the pre chest. Ultimate device and combo. Hot potato book and bank. And. Combo one, and in here, human hot potato book, read you two. I'm definitely taking that. Really need that. Not that. And another dungeon, just the three of us again. Not the same three people, but just three. Let's check the loot. Feather falling. Feather falling ultimate device. Rejuvenate. And wisdom rejuvenate. And nothing. So I'm. Um, Probably taking the free chest. Yeah, it looks like I'm just taking the free chest this time. Another floor 5 completed. As plus this time, finally. Got a full team as well, so let's check the loot. Infinite quiver, rejuvenate, rejuvenate, uh, bank and rejuvenate. Ultimate device and overload. Might take that. And shadow assassin boots and rejuvenate. I don't think that's worth it. I think that 1.5 mil, but I think overload is more than 1 mil, so I might take that one. And another dungeon, as this time we only had uh, damage dealer. So let's check the loot. Um, bank 1, bank 1 combo, uh, this time rejuve for 100. Probably gonna take that one. And bank can rejuve. And in this one, uh, nothing, nothing. So I'm taking this one. This done for 100k, it's not that. There we go. I managed to get a nice team together to finish the floor 6. And we got an S plus. So uh, let's check out the loot. Uh, free chest, rejuvenate 1. Gold chest, ultimate wise. Combo, ultimate wise, ultimate wise. And obsidian chest. Giant tooth. And uh, last hand, I don't think that's worth a lot. Bedrock chest. You get a Necromancer's Lord helmet for 2 million. I'm gonna have to look that up. I'm not sure how much that is, but I don't think it's 2 million. So it's probably gonna be a gold chest for now. But that is going to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like. Really helps out. And I'll see you in the next Yo, video. I ain't here for the money. I ain't here for the fame. Though it might be nice to. For you, come along.